Was it a prank or a direct threat targeting police? A flag torched on an officer's porch. Detectives in New Baltimore are working to find the arsonist. 7 Action News reporter Andrea Isom caught up with an investigator working the case. Well, police officers right here in New Baltimore, brothers and sisters in blue, are working really hard to try to figure out who destroyed, who dishonored property, a flag belonging to a fellow officer. Not from this department, but still it's one of their own. We didn't know if it was an attack on him or if it was an attack on the police and law enforcement as a whole. The flag went up in flames on St. Clair Drive. It was mounted to a home on the porch belonging to an officer of the law. Investigators are not saying which branch, but nevertheless, this flag. American flag that was the thin blue flag, which represent police and first responders. The thin blue line is respect to falling officers in the line of duty. Now this one is forever changed, charred, and frayed. We're hoping that this is an isolated incident. Mm -hmm. Soon after, a plethora of police showed up at the scene. We call in a K-9 unit and we did have a short track, which ended approximately a block away, which we believe they may have gotten in a vehicle and drove off. Detective Sergeant Stevens has been abiding by the oath to serve and protect for almost 40 years. To see this? We in this country have protected it with our lives and give respect to the people who support the flag as we give respect to you if you don't. Now detectives were able to figure out that this happened Wednesday night between 815 and 820. That's just five minutes, folks. So thankfully the fire did not spread into the home and no one was hurt. But they're asking people who live in that neighborhood, if you have security cameras, check them. And if you know anything at all about this situation, please say something now. In New Baltimore, I'm Andrea Isom, 7 Action News. St.